Dr. Evans. I'm going to save you a lot of time and money, okay? It's all your parents' fault. <laughs> Marjorie? Oh, she had to take off. Family issues. <sighs> Look, I know you think you're pretty good at this head shrinking stuff, but thanks to you, my head is about to explode, and I don't know what to do. I focused on the man in my dreams, and now I found out that my mystery caller and Clark are the same person. The same. Unbelievable. Up until today, he couldn't buy his way out of a speeding ticket. And, and now he can hold down an alter ego? Lois, take a step back. What do you think is more likely? that your mysterious caller and Clark are the same man, or that you're trying to make them one person in order to create your dream man. Okay, they're not that different. My mystery caller is brave and selfless, and so is Clark, in his own way. I can't believe how difficult this must have been for him to carry his secret all this time. I just want to tell him that it doesn't matter to me. But maybe coming clean isn't the best idea either. Right now, Clark has this really big decision to make. And more than anything, I just want to help. But I'm not sure how. Wait. I know what I have to do. Thanks, Doc. You're a gem. There's got to be something to this therapy stuff.